Hello everybody, it's Joe here and welcome back to Open TTD. Today you join us pretty much where we left off last time, as per usual, where we have our logs, we've got our freight train going, everything is just coming together. We've got plenty of money in the bank, a hundred grand nearly, and uh, yeah, I'm I'm thoroughly enjoying this so far. Uh, what is it that we're actually using on that? I can't remember what loco it was. Uh, b b b was it a 56? Yeah, it's a 56 grid uh, to transport our, uh, our logs up and down. There, of course, just in case you're not familiar and you've just joined us this episode, uh, they're going to take to the uh, the sawmill, which then the goods go into our two major cities, which are Setwood and, of course, Princhurch. Both cities which don't particularly like me. Setwood are getting better. I'll give them that. I will give them that. Uh, I think I've also... I've, I've not managed to bulldoze this bit of road yet, have I? They still don't let me. They still won't let me. Oh, Infuriating, absolutely infuriating, because of course we've got these trains that we want to do things with. We've got the buses going to Setwood Interchange, we've got, um, you know, so we've got plenty happening, but it's just, for us, it's it's not, you know, it's uh, we're, we're just struggling at this moment in time. Now what I do want to get going is, uh, is a nice regional style railway line, like a, a north to south. I don't know if that's north to south. Is that north to south? Nobody really knows. Maybe that's north to south. Uh, so like kind of a... Yeah, I want a regional line going through Princhurch and Setwood, like with lots of high frequency trains. Uh, right, hang on. So what we'll do, we'll just build you down here. There we go. I reckon it'll probably end up being two track. Let's have a look. What have we, so we're going to go by beading wood, obviously, because we've got uh, we've got the station pretty much set up, raring to go there at beading wood. So what we'll do, beading wood is just a normal town, isn't it? Yeah. We'll pop it there. There we go. And then with beading wood railway station. Now, I don't think we're going to go for electrification on this. I think this is going to be like a, a diesel line of brilliance. There you go. Uh, right, okay. What about that? What do you think to that? We can't have it there, because otherwise the bridge won't go over. Right, okay. Let's just have one platform. You'll like this. So, beading wood. Yeah. And you will also be beading wood there. Yes! Right, and the reason behind that is, of course... Oh, hang on, hang on. Eh, there we go. That can just be a 70 road. It's not going to be... Uh, it's only 30, isn't it, anyway? Oh, hang on. So we're going to have... Uh, yeah, we'll have this fast line coming through the middle. Because Beading Wood, I reckon we will have quite a lot stopping at Beading Wood. And we want things to be able to overtake, don't we? There we go. We might need to do a little bit of hill adjustment there. Yeah, lovely. That'll do. Right, connecting you up to Print Church. Let's do that. Now, of course, we might not get anything running. Oh, we'll get something running today, but I don't know if we'll get the full route done, because obviously these things do take time, don't they? But we'll get some stopping services going. Where else are we going after here? We're going to Grimtown. Have we got any cities around here? Lewisley... Ludown. I'd have thought that'd have been a city because it's in a flipping awkward place. Normally, that's uh, that's kind of what you expect from this, but never mind. Uh, right, okay. Grimtown. Where's our next city that we're aiming for? I mean, you're a city. What have we got down here? Any more cities? No. Oh, Rind Rindingport. Okay, there's quite a few. There's a lot of horses. A lot of horses going off there. Of course, Rindenport, big city on a massive hill. Of course you are. Of course you are. Uh, well, I don't think that would be too far. It's not too unreasonable, is it? Rindenport. Where are we going to put the station, though? We can't put it up there, for obvious reasons. Um, should we put it down here? Down here? You're mad. Yeah, I know. I know. Well, what we'll do is we'll pop it there. And, yeah, that'll do. Mindy Park Woods. Ooh, uh, b -b 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 
da. There we go. We'll have a, a bit of that. Bit of, bit of you and you. Lovely. And uh, some signalling on there. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Bridge over the top. Ah, look at that. Doesn't it look nice? And it hasn't actually upset Rindinport or Trayborn. Traborn? Trayborn? I don't know. Brinshaw. Right, okay. So this is going to be, you guessed it, Rindinport Parkway. Because, of course, it's absolutely nowhere near the flipping city. Yeah, we, we can't really do a lot about that, can we? Just because of the topography of the landscape. Uh, ooh, big word for this time in an afternoon. So we'll pop a bus station there. Pop a bus stop. Yeah, so we're pretty much covering all of Rindinport there. And uh, a couple of bus stations, because obviously I think that when Rindinport grows, this is going to be the, the hub of the action. I reckon we're going to take it away from up here. Uh, and then we'll also just continue via bus through Trayborn. Yeah, lovely. Where's that go to? That'll be fine. There we go. And we'll terminate down in Brinshaw. Seems a nice little town, doesn't it? Why would we not serve Brinshaw? Lovely, lovely, lovely stuff. Let's get a depot. Pop a depot on there, I think. What buses have we got? I was thinking a single decker, so Leyland National will do. Yeah, there we go. Boop, boop, boop. How many do you reckon? Should we go with five for now, with the option to add a few more, if needs be? I mean, I don't think we'll need to add any more buses until we've actually got some trains running, will we? Right, so, where are we going? So we're going up, up there, through Ludown. That's a fairly straight line, actually, or are we going... Are we going Ludown or Grimtown? I reckon it's going to be Grimtown, because that's a fairly straight line there. Down to Plubber. Plubberg, Plubber. We'll have modern platforms. Yeah, lovely. Smashing, and then this beaches place, Overdingport Beaches. We'll have some concrete platforms for you. You're going to be a busy station, aren't you? And Grimtown. Pop Grimtown there. Grimtown Woods. No, we'll just have it Grimtown, please. There we go. Now we need some buses running to there as well, don't we? Because uh, obviously it's out of the city. Tadner End. Have we got any cities round about? Trestown. Winstable. Right, okay. And what we could do is... Uh, oh, this is going to end up with a lot of things. There we go. Grimtown. Right. So Winstable. We're going to pop a station here. For no reason. There we go. We'll pop a bus station there. When you said station, Joe, I thought you meant rail station. I did mean rail station. There we go. Right, default. Four, seven. Pop you on there. We're not going to do anything with that. don't like it. I'm going to move it one that way. There we go. We're not going to do anything with that station yet, but obviously if this city does grow while we're not paying attention to it, then uh, then that will not be good. Mm, there we go. So we'll have two in Grimtown. Yeah, lovely. We're going to come down to Lewisley. Pop another one there just to allow for a bit of expansion. This is then going to come up through Sinston. Sinston. Yeah, that's what we're going with here. There we go, we'll pop you in there. And then you can come up to Beedingwood. Where does that go to? That goes to there. So that's a perfect place for a bus stop, isn't it, really? Right, so in, uh, in Winstable. We'll pop a depot there. I reckon we're going to lose that as the city grows, because you get really tall buildings, and you just lose them, don't you? Right, there we go. You lose your depots. Oh, we could go to Trestown. There we go. Oh, no, we can't do that. We've actually got to serve the place, haven't we? There we go.
Right, okay. Yep, 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 yep. Right, get rid of you. Are you happy now? Yeah, we're going via that town. I think the local authority would be a bit upset if we left them out, wouldn't they? It makes the route a bit longer, but again, if you want to be fast, you go on the train, don't you? This is purely and simply a people-moving exercise. Now, we are going to need at least ten buses and the rest. Do -do 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 -do. Get that all in. Up to Grimtown. And when you think how long this is actually going to take, hopefully people won't choose to use the bus. I hope they'll use the bus, but, I mean, if you're going from Beedingwood to Grimtown, I'd like to think you'd just hop on a little train up there, rather than go all the way around here on this Leyland Olympian. You'd think so, wouldn't you? Uh, I reckon we're going to need 20 vehicles on here, actually, looking at it. I reckon this is going to be high-density people mover. They're off! They're absolutely off. And what we're going to do, if you notice, I conveniently put the railway station there. So that we can uh, we can go for a bit of that. Oh, okay. That's what we're dealing with, is it? We'll just flatten the landscape, because we're rolling in money now. We've got 250 large ones in the bank. So money's really not an issue now, is it? Alright, we're going to come whizzing down here. How are we going to get past this farm? I hear you cry. Uh, that is a problem. We'll just we'll just do a bit of that. That'll do. I don't like deleting the farmland. I would rather go around it, but we're kind of not left with a lot of choice at Overding Port Beaches, are we? Right, hang on. Right, yep, 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 yep. Go down there like that. Lovely. Hang on, where are we? Where have we built to? So we've actually built all the way up to Prince Church now. That could go next to the railway line. I always like a railway line that follows the road. Oh, we've unlocked a new style tram. Oh, we could have used trams, couldn't we? Flipping heck. And what we're going to do while we're here, I don't know. Oh, Overdingport beaches don't actually hate us that much yet, but we're going to pop in a bridge there. There we go, that's nice of us, isn't it? Oh, and do you know what? Look at that, we've just unlocked a class 150 sprinter. Now that is good timing, I think. Print Church isn't going to... Not Print Church, Plubra. Oh, Plubra did let us delete that bridge. We're going to say we'll just tidy that up a little bit. Now, uh, Rimport must remove road. I'm, I'm trying. Oh, I'm trying to build a bridge, that's why. Dear, oh dear me. There we go. Right, so we'll, we'll pop you in there. You can zigzag up here. There we go. And we'll build the road over the top. There we go. That looks a little bit neater than the railway kind of doing a... Doing a... We, we, yeah, you know what I mean. You know exactly what I mean. Pop a cantilever still, 100 mile an hour, I think that's all we need down here, isn't it? Oh, we've gone a little bit far on there. Right, we'll delete you. Oh, look, the buses are here. Right, oh, we've unlocked a 141 pacer as well. Fantastic. Right, well, there we go. That is good stuff. And the signal all the way up here. We'll just use the auto signal because it just works, doesn't it? Oh, hang on. Get rid of that. There we go. We've auto signalled all the way up. Now, what we're going to do here is we're not going to auto signal. We're just going to. Uh, there we go. Like that. Yep. Yeah. Possibly. Is that going to work? Like that. Maybe. Yes. Okay, right. Get a few signals in. Now, the spacing we're using is eight because, again, that just seems to work for me when you end up with trains. I don't like the trains being longer than the signal blocks. That is a problem for me. I really don't like it when that happens. Um, right, hang on. So, they're there. Lovely. So, let's get a train running.
you, you know it's going to be the pacer, don't you? It's got to be the pacer. I don't know why he's not done a 142. I, I, I really do hope to see at some point a, uh, a 142 from uh, Mr. Timberwolf. There we go. Beedingwood, Grimtown, Overdingport Beaches. We're not going to overdo it with the pacers because they're not very quick at accelerating. They do get in the way. So what we're going to do is we're, gonna, we're just going to pop you on there. Yeah, lovely. That should do. So we're gonna we're gonna set you off with the automate, and then we're gonna also have a 150 on here with the same orders. Everything automated. There we go. Oh, look at that! Pacer's on the way. The pacer is on the way. Why has the 150 not come out of the depot? That's bizarre. Oh, he's going now. I wonder why he didn't go out of the depot. You see, the uh, the, the pacer does... Yeah, it's, it's quite slow. It's very slow. Look, it's, it's still not at 75. You'll actually see the 150 catching us in a minute. Like, literally, the 150 is... Uh, you can see he's, at, look, he's having to slow down for the signal again. The pacer is literally getting to 60 and no more. <laughs> Flipping egg. Might not be a good idea putting this pacer on a main line. Oh, excuse me. There we go. Princhurch Woods no longer accepts goods. Oh, that's no good. Hang on, that's the goods place. Is it? Where's Princhurch Woods? Yeah, that is the goods place. Right, okay. Right, hang on. So, Princhurch Woods. Get rid of you. There we go. So now, Princhurch Woods is is in the centre. Is it? Oh, flipping heck, I've done it wrong. Princess Woods, there we go. Now it should accept goods again. Hey! And that is how to move a station. Some call that cheating. I just call it using me noggin. Right, hang on. So what have we got? Where's that pacer gone? Oh, it's there. 150 still hot in, uh, hot on its toes. Hot on its heels, even. Why can it only do 60? Might have to attach a 150 to the front of that just to drag the flipping thing along. Hmm. Because it can do 75, can't it? Information, max speed 75. Yeah, it just doesn't seem to want to. Hmm. Pacers can do 75. I've worked a pacer that's actually got all the way up to 75. It's a little bit of a frightening experience, but, uh, you know, I've, I've, we've been there, we've done that. Right, so we've got that going, so let's think about extending our main line down to... Oh, Exshaw Ridge is actually a city. Are you having a laugh? There's four buildings. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, there's seven buildings. I can't believe that's a city. That's You actually want us to stop a lot of things at Exshaw Ridge. I want a city down here where we can terminate at, actually. We haven't got one. Flipping it, typically. Absolutely typically. Oh, okay, mudding stoke. Right, well what we could do is we could do you'll you'll kind of have, have seen where I'm going with this now, if you haven't already, given the fact that we're using diesel lines, but we can use like a transpennine style network now i kind of wanted to split off earlier to bigger cities but we can like have some units like the main corridor between mud and stone woods and then they can split off some can go up to bodfield some can go to faddingsay bridge some can go around up here you know and they can all split off and all go through this main corridor so we end up with a really busy section of line with lots of trains lots of things to see 
That's what we want. Right, okay. So what we'll do is we'll put some buses in here. Where can they go? Great Tealer. Oh, you're a city as well! Flipping egg. Right, well, of which case, if you're a city... We'll go down there like that. Yeah, up. We'll have some trams between the two big cities. Hang on, one, two, three, four, five, six. Great Tilo Mines, good name for a station. There we go, so we'll pop you on there. We'll have a, a tram stop there. And get rid of you. There we go. Oh, look at that. Perfect. And then you can you can just kind of whiz down next to the railway. And we've unlocked a new tram, haven't we? That centenary tram. Oh, I don't want you to go down that one, though. No, okay. Yeah, one over. That'll do. So you can go through there on the tram, yep. Yeah. Don't know why we're doing this, but it'll be fine. It's kind of a, a convoluted way around. And does prevent us from using double deckers. It just avoids the city centre, doesn't it? On the tram. So we've got the tram there, yeah, lovely. Tram there. Tram down here at the central stop. We're then going to go over the railway line, which we haven't built yet. That'll do. We could actually have just sacked it off and gone straight up here. There we go, that's quicker. Yeah, yeah. And actually, because I've deleted that farm, we'll delete that bit as well. Just to neaten it up a little bit. And you. There we go. Does the farm replenish? I don't think it does, does it? There we go. That's nice, isn't it? There we go. Lovely. Actually, what I'm going to do is we'll delete that little section. Right, so we'll get our usual station junction put in. Oh, hang on, get some signals going properly. We actually need some trams, don't we? Because otherwise, if these stations all go unused, the cities are just going to despise us, aren't they? Absolutely despise us. So we'll pop a depot on there just to prevent any expansion. That was a silly choice, Joe. Yeah, get rid of that. We'll pop a depot on there. It's practically a house then, isn't it? Right, centenary tram. We can't use double-deckers because you built that flipping great big tunnel. There we go. Five of you should do. It's a nice quick service. 43 miles an hour between towns. Right. So we're going over there now. Exshaw Ridge is this is one that we're gonna uh, we're gonna have as like a, a two platform but big station because everything's gonna stop here. But at the same time, mm, hmm, I don't like it. Right, okay, concrete maybe four four platform. Exshaw Ridge, there we go. That'll have to do, won't it? There we go. So this is going to be then four track down here. I, I don't know if you can tell that I'm just completely making this up as I go along. 
Does it really come across there? 100 miles an hour, yep. Yeah. Because again, this is this is my little Transpennine style route. There we go. Get you in there. I'm just right there. We go. Try and bring them all over. I think it's there, isn't it? If uh, if it serves me right, there we go. Oh, hang on. There, there, there. there. Oh, what do we want? A three one nine. Oh, there's all these great units coming out, and we've not got enough. Uh, we should have started earlier on. Problem is, though, is people don't like starting earlier on, do they? Uh, right, there we go. Yeah, yeah. yeah, when I started to transport Fever series in the mid-1800s, uh, nobody watched it. When I started in the 80s, everyone was like, oh, yeah, get me a bit of that. So, yeah, people just don't like starting in the Steam era. Right, there we go. So this is the logic between behind having that as a four-platform station. Because, again, everything is going to stop there. Because, as you will see, two lines are going to branch off and go to here. Yeah. Yeah, with me so far? Two of these lines. Are going to go up here. So it's like a proper little... Well, we can make use of that cutting, can't we? There we go. And then they're going to join on. See? Love it. And then these lines are going to go round like that. Although I don't know how they're going to go up here. They could just go up there, couldn't they? Like that. Yes. Right, okay. And then I don't know where these are going. I've, I've not got a plan for these lines yet, but they'll go somewhere, won't they? There we go. Look at that. I mean, we've completely built that with no, like, we, we don't have any need for any of this at the moment. It's all just nonsense, isn't it, really? But... Uh, it's just a little bit of future-proofing, because I reckon these are going to be some big cities here. They obviously hate me already. They hate our transport company, because we're trying to bring them good things. And the, these people around here don't like, they're completely against future, uh, you know, they're against new things. This is going to be a sharp corner, but it's, uh, it's what's going to have to happen. Because the railway will then run parallel to the tram line, look at that. It's nice, isn't it? There we go, we've got a nice little... Nice little loop there. And we've actually unlocked. Uh, unlocked? We've connected the whole route, so that's good. Now what we are going to have... Is a stopping service that links the two. That links the two cities. So there's not a fast or a slow line here. There's just two parallel lines that run. We're going to have to put waypoints on there, because otherwise it'll, just, it'll cause carnage. Uh, right, okay. Yeah, yeah. Ooh, a dinger. Dinger. Dinger 100. The auto signals have actually done a pretty nice job there. Normally they don't, and it ends up looking absolutely horrendous. Don't need them on there, though, do we? Lovely. Yeah, so what we're going to have... I'm going to put a, uh, a depot down here. I realise time is pressing on. We're going to put a depot down there. Yeah. I'll just connect you up so you can access all lines. And we're going to have a stopping service. Uh, what are we having? Yeah, let's have the pacer, because it can't really get very fast anyway, can it? You're going to go up here. You're going to stop at Exshaw Ridge. I'm going to come round to Great Tilo Mines, yeah, and then down here. So actually, the, what we're going to end up having... Yeah, lovely. We'll have two of you. There we go. What we're going to end up having is... Because uh, that's a city. 
that's a city, that's a city, and that's a city. We'll have express services coming, oh, 90. Express services coming from up here. They're going to come down to Rindin Port, yeah, and then they're going to branch off. So some are going to come down the left, some are going to come down the right. Some will come, some expresses will come down to Great Tilo and go on these two lines somewhere else. And then some will come down to Mudding Stoke, Mudding Stone, not Mudding Stoke. This connection between the two will only ever be the stopping services. I like that. I think that's an excellent plan. We've got the foundations of a brilliant network. But what we do need to see just before we finish, Set would like me. There we go. Look at that. So we're going to bulldoze part of Setwood and that house as well. Get rid of them just because I'm feeling particularly... Uh... Ah, there we go. We've actually got a proper line there at Setwood. Interchange. Brilliant. Now we're going to tunnel that before I forget. Yes, look at that. We've done it. We've done it. We've done it. Thank you so much for watching. I really do hope that you have enjoyed uh, today's episode. If you have... Please do make sure that you click that like button. It helps the video do a little bit better. And, uh, you know, it's always appreciated by myself. Of course, I'm always open to hear your wonderful suggestions. Please do let me know in the comments section there. And uh, I can't promise that everything will be implemented. But I certainly do like to take a look. I don't like that. We'll have uh, we'll have a room for some houses. I'll just raise you up a bit. Have Setwood hating me? No, they're, weirdly enough, they still like me after I've done all this terraforming around their city. Uh, but yeah, thank you so much for watching, and hopefully I'll uh, I'll see you next time. Cheerio! Goodbye for now.